guys, happy Monday. It's good to see you. Well, I'm not actually seeing you. I'm actually looking at myself on my cell phone recording an introduction to this virtual unit and virtual school that we'll be doing here for a time, I guess. Are you in there? Can you see me? I just want to make sure. Not quite sure. Okay, anyways, I hope you can see me. We'll be working out the kinks and the bugs in this over the next couple of weeks, I'm sure, and trying to figure out what is the best procedure to hold virtual school. Hmm. Well, at least you get to sleep in a little bit, and it's at your own pace, and kind of everybody's homeschooling right now. I don't know about you, but I'd prefer being at school. I'd prefer seeing you. And having a good time. Anyways, I'm having a hard time spinning this into the Roman unit. Um, this virtual stuff just doesn't fit with ancient Rome. But we'll see what we can come up with. Alright, so I'm going to be attaching some videos on lessons to emails to your parents. And hopefully they'll be able to download them as needed if you need instruction and help with subjects. So, I'll be videotaping each subject, and I'll be putting it in a video, and in the title of the email, it should say something like, math lesson for a certain week, or history lesson for a certain week. And if you're not understanding something when you read through the text then uh, perhaps if you click on an, uh, the video link, uh, maybe it'll help if I explain it. Also, you can text or through your parents' phone or email me through your parents' email, um, respond via email, or even the, the, the PAN function on Sycamore, you're welcome to do that. I'll be checking those a lot. I, to submit your work, you're going to be taking a picture of it, scanning it, or doing something like that, and then uploading it into email, or sending it to me. The best way to do it is to send it to me via email, and if you would, please, make sure your parents title the email, Math Homework, History Homework. And only send one uh, subject's work per email. It'll help me to organize and grade things, um, I think. So if, if you could do that, that would be very helpful. I'll try to send out a reminder about that as we go along. And uh, it will make the best out of this. Anyways, hopefully we'll be able to do the Zoom thing soon. And it was good connecting with some of you the other day, so hopefully that'll be something we can uh, get on and do more of, um, but we'll have to schedule times and we'll have to really coordinate that with other classes and brothers and sisters on the computer, so anyways, just be patient. God is working through this, and uh, the Bible says that it's better to trust in God than put your confidence in man, so... As you're at home going through this time, make sure that you're doing your devotions. Um, write them in your daily agenda as usual. And at some point in time, Lord willing, we will go over those questions. We will go over those things. Yes, you could ask your parents all that too. But we can also continue to have those discussions, generate those discussions when we're able to do Zoom more often as a class. So I'd like to do things as just as normal, normal Bible homework, normal uh, Bible quizzes and spelling tests and all that good stuff, only you get to do it online. So um, in the meantime, let's just make the best out of this. You're going to have fun and hopefully we'll get a chance to get together soon and all this will be over, and this will be one to uh, a story to tell for years to come, and uh, how God saw us through this. So remember, God hath not given us a spirit of fear, but one of power and of love and of a sound mind. 
Well, most of us have a sound mind, but I'm not quite sure of that fifth grade teacher, Mr. Marquis. Okay, well, anyways, I'm looking forward to connecting with you and seeing you, with you, seeing you and talking with you some more. And um, hopefully we'll get through this quickly. So, all right, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.